in data communications, a narrow band signal is good enough to carry users' data. But in wireless and mobile communications, air being the medium of transfer, users' data get corrupt due to interference. Spread spectrum address this issue. The core principle of spread spectrum is spreading the bandwidth needed to transmit data. Spread spectrum is made such a wide and noise-like and noise-like signals are uh, very much less immune to narrow bandwidth uh, interference. Let us see what is actually happening. The narrow band signal is spread and sent through air. Broadband and narrow band interference add up to the signal. The receiver knows how to despread the signal. Receiver reconstructs the signal since the power level of the user signal is high enough. Because spread spectrum are much wider, they are transmitted at lesser power density. Lesser power means lesser energy, lesser interference and greater capacity.